Hello and welcome to Retro Roulette, uh, where we ask, um, where we tell you Liebe is für alle da. Uh, I am your zigzag, Michael Riley. With me is Du hast Dan Forgione. Du hast me. Ich tu der wie, Jason Amherst. I am the table. <laughs> and Angel, Billy Carter. That was just Billy saying hi in German. Uh, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> that, was, that was Billy saying I love you in German. Yeah. It's just German is a really abrasive language. <laughs> oh, man. We're going to play a Papa Roach song. Wait, what? <laughs> you'll, you'll get it in a second. <laughs> Scars. Scars. Oh, God. I tear my open. I saw myself shot. My wow. weakness is I have no nuts. So, no uh, th thinking about like the hockey games and stuff, we wouldn't get a Blitz style hockey game again until <laughs> 2002. Until the that, was that NHL hits? Yeah. yeah. I don't think that ever came out in N64. 2002, the N64 was our, that was around the end of it. Yeah, no, it was it was GameCube by then. So no no more fun hockey games. It'll just be generic uh, generic generic uh, bull e -E -E. Crap. These cars are very interesting. Green pricks. Carbon, I guess. Wait, there's, Brand, a, there's a cheat code bricks. menu. Oh, was there? Yeah. Where'd you see that? At the bottom of options, wasn't there? Under settings? No? Yeah, right there. Yeah, password. password. Unlock all cars. Uh, unlock cups. Uh, activate all cheats. Okay. I don't, I don't know what we're talking about. Uh, under the passwords at the bottom of the options. The fuck are you talking about? Down there, password Z A. See right there. That says Z R. Well, Z R, whatever. Either way, uh, if you enter in uh, W L L V D D, uh, you will get all the cars. Or. Uh, GG WWOO for all cars and cups. So Jace what? will appreciate. Jace will appreciate this. A little earlier today, I uh, reached out to Go Goobus Dubus. Ooh, ooh, Goobus! I like what, Goobus. What was Goobus. that password? The the, the GG WWOO. Uh, okay. Woo! <laughs> go go woo 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 woo! Because I I I would like for him to try and do like a little animation of a couple of clips from episodes of the performers I know. Oh, cool! Now, whether or not he'll answer me is a different story. All right, all the cars, nice. Let's go I with the best one, the Panther. Might as well. I do enjoy his animation of Winnie the Pooh is the president of the world. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, okay. So I want to make the horror movie. movie. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> I still say my favorite is the, uh, Hello, you, I'm Michael Mouse, and I'm Steve Bootwood. Toot, toot. Oh, <laughs> a talking boat. What a whimsical world we live in. Holy smokes. So this is just Mario Kart, but with animal themed cards. That's what it seems like. And taking place in a virtual reality world. Oh, um, apparently that was not a good thing. Didn't really do Whatever. much to me, so... No, that's true. Whoa, whoa. Uh-oh! 
Bye. Oh no, I got oh, no. I got lifted out of the into the air for half a second. How terrible. That was a that was a minor inconvenience. That yeah, was. Wow. It took over a minute for a first lap. What a fun course. Hmm. Do, 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 I, I will admit, oh, I like the nice. sampled rhythm. The the sampled music rhythm there. Some nice drum and bass there. And Mike's doing fairly well because, well, at least the, the controls are pretty good in this. You know, as yeah. soon as you said that, somebody passed him and now he's second. Good job. Uh, let's see here. Super computable and uh, computable. Supercomputer Animal Racing Simulator. Which is what Scars apparently stood for, but is never mentioned. Okay. By Vivid Image, published by Ubisoft. <laughs> While working on various ports of Street Racer, Vivid Image and Ubisoft <coughs> decided it would be a good idea to create a 3D racing game specifically for next gen consoles. Uh, Mev mm -hmm. Dink, who headed Vivid <laughs> Image, uh, developed the concept of cars based on wildcats and other animals, with tracks that reflected their natural habitats. Ubisoft loved the idea and provided some of their own graphics and sound design resources to help fill the otherwise strained team. You'd never get that from Ubisoft nowadays. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, originally, the game was going to be called Vivid Racing. After some iterations, they decided on Scars... As development progressed, coders struggled with balancing the high level of detail and performance with space limitations of the tracks. Courses Ooh. needed to be shortened, and as a result, many of the technical turns and obstacles were condensed, creating a much more challenging experience than they originally planned. Okay. Uh, Nintendo Power gave it a 7.4 out of 10. Um, Electronic Gaming Monthly gave it a 6 out of 10. GameSpot gave it a 5.7 out of 10. IGN, 7.9. Um, PC Gamer gave it 68%. Um, EGM gave the PlayStation port slightly higher numbers, 6.5 out of 10. Game Informer gave it an 8 out of 10. However, according to the overall game rankings, the N64 version still has the higher score of 71% over the PC and PlayStation's 66 and 67, uh, respectively. So, mostly decent scores. Yeah. Uh, okay. Dr. Zombie of GamePro said of the PlayStation version, you shouldn't pass up Scars as it, just another kitty Mario Kart-style racer. By taking a look under this hood, you'll find a lot of fun action. One issue later, he said of the N64 version, Mario Kart fans will find Scars similar, but with a much harder edge. The game's action is fast and furious, with enough variety in the tracks and weapons to warrant replay. I just like the ah. fact that he's apparently called Dr. Zombie. Yeah. Yeah, Scars is a great game. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go eat some brains. <laughs> All we want to do is eat your brains. Eat your brains. Eat your brains. Uh, it's, it's, it, it's a legit song. No, I know. Brains. Have brains, been brains there. for lunch. Brains for breakfast. Brains for brunch. So brains, brains, I won't lie. I'll eat the brains till the zombie fight. A's are good. A's are good. He's having the music. good, yep. Uh, see, see, he could be talking about drugs. You don't know. Yep. I heard about that song in the uh, One Hit Wonderland video for Unbelievable by EMF. Yeah, I'm just wondering, uh, looking at this map, what creature resides in Flaming Caverns? Well, um, the flaming, the flaming cheetah, of course. Yes. Dangerously uh, cheesy. Uh, Ethel Merman. 
I yeah. don't reside in a flaming jungle, you stupid fucking yeah. bitch. I disagree. I believe that is what San Francisco is called. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a flaming jungle. Oh, you, you are <laughs> such a clever fat piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> Ethel Merman. <laughs> How dare you? I might be fat. I might be a piece of shit. I'm definitely not whatever the third thing you said was. Devastatingly handsome? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen. I have it on good authority. Yes, that Navi. E that EG <laughs> I have it on good authority that EG Daily wants to vote. Oh, that's good. As long as she doesn't walk up to me and go, a baby's gonna screw you, then we'll be all good. <laughs> a baby's oh. gotta screw what a baby's gotta screw. Please don't. And by that, I mean you. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I'm just, that's creepy. <laughs> I don't like it. I prefer if she was Dottie and not Tommy Pickles. <laughs> Listen. I don't know. Oh, she was attracted to Pee Wee Herman. So. Exactly. That's why I think that that Dottie would be a better, a better, a better choice suited to me. <laughs> she could have, cause she could have a big adventure on my Pee Wee. <laughs> <laughs> she sucked on my Pee Wee. <laughs> <laughs> she connected the dots on my. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Connect pretty sure, blah, pretty blah, sure blah. that's herpes. <laughs> Connect the herpes source. La 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 la. The secret word of the Speaking day of is Pee chlamydia. Ha <laughs> uh, ha. Pee Wee's big, uh, not Pee Wee's big invention, but Pee Wee's Playhouse. The show is on Tubi right now. Oh nice! Watch for free. Congratulations. Are you a Tubi spokesman? Heard... <laughs> How no, much is Tubi now? How much does Tubi pay you to, to drop them, to name drop them like that? Yeah. Absolutely nothing. Ah, so then. So Tubi you're being cheated. Like you were cheated. I'm a liar. No. It's, uh, so, something, mm. something is streaming on Tubi. Ooh, nobody gives a shit. Exactly. Boop, I mean, boop, they, 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 got, they got Tokusatsu on there, but that's about all I care about. They got other cool stuff on there. You just gotta look. They got a good. They got a good assortment of anime. I, I, I can say that much. They got shitty parody movies about boning. Yeah, I watched. Uh, I watched an old '80s movie called Joysticks. Oh my god! Oh, I love that movie. You know. I I don't even know what that movie is, but I can take a guess. Oh, a bunch of guys perving on women in an arcade uh, building. A poor am piece, I, am but I far with off? an arcade. Huh? Uh, poor not piece, but with an too arcade. far off, but not actually not a lot of pervs in that movie. Let yeah. me guess. Let me guess. There is a line. Oh, she could grab my joystick any time. No. Uh, there's no. literally an arcade game about streaking. In the, I want her to play with my Donkey Kong. Oh. It's actually they introduced this movie introduced the first time uh, Super Pac Man. Yeah. Hmm. Movie. Uh, there, yeah, it was. There is, it, it was a moment a, similar to, uh, you know, uh, when they revealed uh, Mario Brothers Three. Yeah, and the Wizard. Yeah. Oh. But uh, um, the the most it's actually notable thing watch. is that uh, uh, Rico, Uncle Rico from Napoleon Dynamite, Suave. was in there as King Vidiot. Oh, oh yeah, that yeah, was him. Him, him is like Uncle Rico. Hey, what's up? But the main character was uh, a a character named McDorfus. Dorfus? McDorfus yeah, the nerd. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Office, the nerd. Rico. Ale, ale. 
Oh, wait, no, Dorfus. He was the, the fat guy. Yeah, yeah. He was actually and kind of enjoyable. And a on that can handle me. That's why Even I'm a Even if he was just, uh, you know... Wait a second. We have John Joe, Belushi at home. Hold on a second. Joe Don Baker was in Joysticks? Yep. Yes, Joe Don Baker is in it, yes. Oh, ho. The old, the old Dude, boozy it's worth, a, it's worth a watch. It's worth a watch. I, I watched it with uh, Rick not too long ago. The old Rick. The old Kate and Caboodle. Yeah, you, you guys remember Rick Tarassi? Rick is yeah, Tarassus. Yeah. Yes! Talk how's to Rick he, all the time. How's he I, doing? Yeah, he's doing alright. You know, still doing his podcast. God damn. Who does a podcast for that long? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh... Gee, I don't know. Yeah, stop. Next, you'll be telling me. Stop at 10 years, I always say. Yeah. I mean, uh, the one that I'm currently on uh, is almost at the big 200 at the time of this recording. 200 years? Jesus uh, Christ. Well, episodes, but still. <laughs> okay. The first episode was during the Revolutionary War. Right. I mean, yeah, 200 episodes. They were the best is of a, times. They were the worst of the times. Blur, the blurst of times. Uh, <laughs> no, the. Uh, yeah, 200 is an admirable number. I think uh, Metalcast was actually fairly close to 500 before we finally stopped. Yeah, it was. It was like 480 something. Or something I think 492 like was the last episode. Yeah. So we got really, really close to 500. Well, originally it was going to be the 500th episode was going to be right near the 10 year anniversary, and then we stopped doing the show for a bit, and then we brought it back for like a month and a half. And then I got bored with it again. I'm just you like, actually, you, we got up to 496. Oh, 496. So, Dang. yeah. Wow. Yeah, pretty close. Oh, wow. Hey, you want to bring back the show for a month so we can have 500 episodes? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Let's just get it even 500. Yeah, yeah. And, then, and then stop. The summer of mental stop. cast. <laughs> uh, thoughts on Scars, I mean, Dane? You know... That was actually pretty fun. I, it was a nice uh, little uh, Mario Kart clone. I, I didn't see a problem with it. I enjoyed it. Okay, Jason. It was all right. You know, uh, apparently, uh, you can use bullets to shoot opposition weapons. Mm. That's kind of neat. I did not know that. Well, I guess that's why there's a hint. Also, that background is like wobbly. <laughs> wobbly. Billy, this would be the type of game that you would you would get invited to a birthday party and you would all be sitting around playing this game. This is that type of game. You know what I mean? You, somebody had an N64, they then, brought it, or your friend already had it, and then you all connected your four. And then afterwards, it's like, do you guys want to watch joysticks? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is a uh, this is not that bad. Uh, obviously, it's no Mario Kart. Nothing is really, um, but it's it's fun. It's not bad. It plays very well. It controls very well. Uh, it, yeah, I would have played more of it if we'd had time. Scores out of ten, Dane. Eight. Jason. Eight. Billy. Eight. Yeah, eight. 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 Eight 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 eight
now don't that doesn't take away from the fun of this port though right like the hub world is is not there and things like that yeah but nonetheless it's still if if this is what you started off with it was still a good game i know a lot of guys that only played this version of this i mean i played the pc version but uh <laughs> But uh, there's a lot of guys that had this, and I would go over to my friends, and he had an N64, and he had this version. And I still had a lot of fun with this version. Yeah, I'm playing the Night Dive remake on the other show right now, and the Night Dive remake is really good. But that should be no surprise. Yeah. And after Mike totally just rage quit Project Warlock 2, like, fuck this fuck. Yeah. Well, that's because I spent the same episode on literally the same section of the the game. It's just like at that point, I'm I'm over it. It just wasn't fun Fuck anymore. This shit, I'm out. Mm -mm. Fuck this shit, Fuck I'm this out. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Oh yeah. Uh. Smell my butt crack. Smell my big old hairy crack. Smell my butt crack. Um, I would rather not. Thank you. Oh, there's somebody out there that wants to smell my butt crack. Oh, wow. Um, two for $15 Steam Keys. Oh, yeah. Steam On, uh, Play Steam Asia. Keys? <laughs> I swear I thought you said Steam, Steam Keys. Keys for a second. Like, hey, Stinky. Hey, you can smell my butt crack for two for one Steam Keys. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's true. What a bargain! What a bargain! You can smell the it's butt cheeks. Spectacular. Sniff it and whiff it. Sniff it, whiff it, waft it. Skip it, skip it. And the very best thing of all, there's a there's cow a on this ball. Oh. <laughs> Try to hit uh, your very best score. See if you can do a whole lot more. A whole more. lot more. Skip it. Skip, skip it. it. There we go. That's much better. That, that one, one toy caused more freaking ankle injuries. I was about oh. to say, skip it. The game that causes ankle injuries are plenty. Uh, also, moon boots. <laughs> moon shoes. Moon oh, shoes. Moon shoes. <laughs> Kid powered anti gravity shoes. Moon shoes. <laughs> I never once saw those in stores, so I swore they weren't real. Three, three, like was... we'll laugh at you. Moon shoes. Moon I feel shoes. like there was a commercial where the guys were like, invisible shoes. Oh. <laughs> also, the uh, boxes of nails don't have the Nine Inch Nails logo on them in this. Yeah. That's a terrible, that's a terrible line. Yeah. Because the Nine Inch Nails soundtrack is not in this version of the game. Yeah. Right. I wouldn't have been able to support it. Support it. Jesus. Rapid fire in these nails. That might be the accoutrements, I'll be honest. <laughs> Not sure. I go through, when I grab these, I go through them uh, to test them and also activate cheats, and then I probably forget what cheats I activate. So. Uh, well, well, well. Ah, piss. Come on. Eh, Come on. Eh, eh. A little to the left. What the eh, fucking eh. thing? Eh, eh, eh. Uh -oh. Double barrel I, shotgun. Let's see how set fast it fires. I have properly. Eh, eh. Oh Thank my you. god! Oh, holy crap. Two towels. Two towels. <laughs> towel, 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 towel. towel. <laughs> all right, all right. You, you got cheats plucked in, right? Yeah, apparently. Yeah. Which ones do I even have turned? I'm, I gotta look now because this. I am now intrigued. That shot. I have that infinite shot ammo and infinite armor, infinite bio suit, infinite health, rapid fire. Okay, yeah, dude. There is just one called rapid fire. All right, that's understandable. <laughs> For a rapid firing shotgun, double barrel. Yeah, basically, it's a double barrel shotgun Uzi. Saw, saw, my, sawed off. By the way, uh, 
Yeah. Oh no, you're in the pee pee water. What? Uh, what could you say? Piss about water. That? Uh, you're, oh no. You're, you're invincible, and nothing will ever stop you. Get out of the pee get out of the piss water, please. Piss wash gully. Piss wash gully. Well, uh, that's that's a location in Borderlands, piss wash gully. Oh, don't, don't, doesn't don't you just love going to piss wash gully? It's my favorite. Don't you just love? Well, uh, the the joke about love... that is in uh, in in the movie trailer. Roll up the windows. Roll up the windows. What the hell? <laughs> oh my god! It got in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Well, I cannot I wait till I get say... some of the other weapons in this and try them with rapid fire. <laughs> I, have, I heard one person say, why are they making it so funny? It's like, have you ever played the game? Yeah, exactly. Borderlands is hilarious. Chase. <laughs> Chase, why? Okay, I have to see this now. <laughs> I don't. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck is going on there. Don't worry about it. I saw the picture. <laughs> the French are gay. He helps me cook. Ratatouille too. <laughs> More like Ratatouille poo. <laughs> yeah, yeah walk into my steady stream of bullets. My steady stream of bullets. <laughs> are you? Okay. My lady. I'm using fabric protection. Baha Blast. Baha Blast. Baha Blast. Baha Blast. Baha Blast. Scarlett Johansson had an enormous Johansson. <laughs> that's, oh, that's very disturbing. <laughs> Robot oh, chicken joke. Oh, disturbing. <laughs> oh, Jesus. It's like having a chainsaw, but with Helps bullets. <laughs> chainsaw <laughs> bullets. I shoot chainsaw chainsaws. Bullets. Yeah, basically, I shoot chainsaws. <laughs> chainsaw bullets. Chainsaw bullets. bullets. Chainsaw motherfucking bullets. Excuse me while I vomit death all over the screen. Yeah. At first, at first, before I thought it was Ratatouille, I thought it was what's his face, uh, Greer, not not David Allen Greer, but uh... Pam Greer, <laughs> Richard Gear. Yep. yep. Mm -hmm. no, what? That's not even fucking close. <laughs> I thought it's not David Allen Greer, but Richard mm -hmm. Gear. Two completely different people. I don't even know how you would confuse them. <laughs> Oh, uh, no, no, no. Richard Gere is what happens when you, uh, Shove a try to inject, <laughs> inject shit into your dick to try to make it look bigger. Ew. Don't put uh, that. Don't inject shit. Gear. Don't inject yeah. shit into your dick. Don't be a shit yeah, dick. That's the that's way to get sepsis. Yeah. <laughs> Why? That is the 25th letter of the alphabet. <laughs> well, well, because uh, apparently uh, that has been a thing lately. Penis filler gone wrong. <laughs> Phyllis Diller, uh, penis filler. <laughs> <laughs> no, pe people are paying upwards beep, beep, of people. fifteen grand to try to have bigger dicks. <laughs> you know Ew. what? I, I've had no complaints about mine, so I, I'm, I'm just leaving it as is. Well, good for you. No, no need for filler. <laughs> Ashley Miller. Hey, uh, you can call me One Piece because my dick is all filler. <laughs> <laughs> all filler. <laughs> I... <laughs> Honestly, I don't think there's that much filler in one piece i think it's more Naruto oh my god what the hell <laughs> i'm surprised this hasn't crashed the game <laughs> that's so good i gotta switch back to the uh shotgun for the next room though because there's a button i gotta shoot or the nail gun works 
Secret Tunnel! Secret Tunnel! Bro, six, bro, 627 axes at the same time. Yeah. One of these has to hit that scrag. Oh! There it went. Man. There we secret. go. Secret uh, fucking tunnel! I will be right secret back, guys. Secret motherfucking I tunnel! Right. I will be right back with the secret tunnel! Yeah. Uh, also known as my anus. <laughs> as my anus. No, he said secret tunnel. That one's well known. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, I just realized I could probably rocket jump my ass off if I get, once I get the rocket launcher. Oh my god. I think I'm going to try rocket to break the game. to the moon! Yeah. As soon as I get the rocket launcher, I'm going to try to break the fucking game. You better believe it. Habib it. Habib it. Habib it. Itty bitty boat. Itty bitty boat. Itty bitty booty. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You know you make me want to shit. Pull my pants down um, and shit. Um. Well, okay. <laughs> I, don't, I don't. I don't know what's oh, no. going on. <laughs> I just wanted again. to see this. Turbo whacking. <laughs> don't tell people my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> What I do in the privacy of my own home is my business. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my Lord. <laughs> what are you posting? <laughs> <laughs> What's what? going on now? I don't know. What? I don't get it's an ancient meme from Mountain 4chan. Dude, Baja Blast Trojans, and then Habibit. Itty bitty boat, itty bitty boat, Habibit. Uh huh. All right. That, that is that is a picture that dates back to 2004 on 4chan. Jesus Christ! I think I've I think I just uh, lost some brain cells reading that picture. Habibit, Twinkie House. Sure. They're they're literally I like what is it? Uh nonsensical phrase uttered on 4chan in reference to an exploitable dialogue scene from the two thousand four gay erotica comic My Wild and Raunchy Son. I'm I guess gonna... the, I guess the original comic is uh Gay and Raunchy? Probably. I guess this is the original picture. Don't do it. No, don't do it. No! Hi. Uh. Oh, okay. It's actually not as bad as I was thought it was. Yeah, no, it's. I want you inside. So. This is why I got confused in the PC games, because in this game, this is where the secret exit is. <laughs> ah. And it's exit. not there in the PC version. Secret exit! So now we're going to go to the best level of all, Ziggurat Vertigo, the level with no gravity. Oops, there goes gravity. Oop, there goes gravity. Whoop, there goes gravity. Oopsie. Okay. Oh, apparently the other half of the comic was uh, this from uh, 4chan, I guess. Oh, God. Twinkle House. It's, it's not as it's not as funny as the first. It's picture just a, it's just a bunch Twinkie of it's just a bunch of Pepe frogs saying tits or get the fuck out. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh my God, I'm floating. No I'm longing for the Dutch. What? No need to get. <laughs> no need to get violent cigarette. Yep. Because that was 4chan in 2004. That's 4chan now. It's still 4chan. <laughs> still 4chan, yeah. Yeah, itty bitty baby, itty bitty boat, Habiba, Twinkie House! <laughs> or 4chan. Yeah. yeah, people would later redraw it as different uh, things like, uh, you know, Metal Gear Solid or uh, itty bitty Gentile, itty bitty Faith. And the itty bitty Gentile. Uh, oh, or, boy. Uh, I'm a charging my laser. I'm a firing my laser. Wow. Zaboobit. Shoop da whoop. Shoop it. The girl hey, who's hard to get. Shoop da whoop is iconic. Oh, yeah. It is a classic. Die, Sprag. Jace, I'm going to uh, send you a picture. I mean, I mean, it's through uh, here on the, the on Facebook, but uh, it's, it's this, this, is, this, this no, this is what my friend dressed as. This is what my wiener God. looks like. <laughs> wow, it's slanted into the left. Hmm. Who'd have thought? Uh, oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> it's the unknown. Yes, yes. <laughs> I love that that became a meme. <laughs> She made that costume herself. The hunt, the, the evil chocolatier that hides in the walls. Oh, I, I saw a few of those at Anime Boston. Oh no, it's the sneak. Uh, from from the uh, Glasgow Wonka experience. Yep. Here we go. Oh boy. So in LA. This is probably yeah, not the did. level to be using the rocket launcher in, uh, getting, considering it's zero gravity. Fuck it. <laughs> Break the game. Break it. <laughs> it just, just makes me go <laughs> all the way to the fucking ceiling. To the moon! <laughs> I could like perpetually stay in the air if I wanted to. <laughs> Dogecoin to the moon. Poor Doge. Mm. It, he actually died. Yeah. He died. Very, he very died. recently. Yeah, have you seen the uh, gravestone? No. What does it say? Uh, do only good every day. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's... Doge. Yeah. Uh, I thought you were going to tell me it said... Uh, much dead, such corpse, wow. Well, uh, it is written in Comic Sans. Oh. That dog has been memed so much. Yep. So whore? To this day. And to be honest, they didn't even know the dog's real age. They're assuming it's 18. Because when they adopted the dog, they didn't know, so they just were like, uh, it's three. <laughs> 47? Who knows how old he really was? I mean... And that doge, Lord, that had it about 20 years. <laughs> it's ridiculous, these rocket jumps. Yeah. It's going to blow myself all the way to the fucking ceiling. Farewell. To the moon. Yeah, to the moon, though. To, to the moon, though. Pow, right in the kisser. Pow, right in the... Oh. Pow, right in the pisser. Cow, right in the pisser. Cow, right. Cow, cow, right in the pisser. Ouch. That must hurt. I got the silver rune key. Oh, yeah. But I, uh, but I digress. You know you make me want a horse. <laughs> what? 
Everybody, everybody okay? <laughs> you know you make me want a piece. Uh, but sale. I digress. You make so me Taz eats a big, uh, a big meal, uh, but I digest. Ha. This is the... Have we done three games on this episode already? Is this the third? No, no. this is the second. This is the second? This is the second. Uh, yeah, first we, we played Scars. Yeah. Yep, we got yeah, Scars, yeah, yeah. Quake. Yep. One more game. Yep. All right. Uh, so let me... Wee! 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 Oh, get the quad damage. That'll make this even funnier. All right, Shambler. You were such a problem in Project Warlock 2, but you're not going to be a fucking problem here. You became what? bored with life. Did you kill yourself? How? What? The fuck? What did you, what did you do? I didn't do shit. Oops. You broke it. Is it because I had quad damage? Is that why? Yeah, probably. There. So I was so Dang. powerful, I killed my invincible self. <laughs> All right. Well, yes, I, I mean, know what I won't sense. be picking up anymore. This game is wonderful. It doesn't make me want to punch a baby. I give it a 10. <laughs> Are we already to that point? <laughs> yeah, we're at to that point. We're at that point. Yeah. Uh, nine. All right, Billy. <laughs> nine. I'll give it a ten. Because we're kind of running out of time. I guess is what yeah. I'm trying. Not really. It's a, we're only forty-one minutes in, forty-two minutes into the episode, so we had plenty of time. But let's do whatever. Yeah, but I mean, there's just gonna be more quake down the line anyway. Yeah, so. we're playing the we're playing the game fully through on the other shows, so that that's fair. All right, yeah. uh, let's see what we're going to play for the last game this episode. But anyway, we digress. I digress. We digest. NBA Jam 99. Uh, well, you might be happy with this one. All right. Ooh. Jam. Da, 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 da. Let the boys be born. Jam 99. Dicks up your ass. What? <laughs> uh, what is jam mode? What does that mean? Uh, that's the actual arcade mode, I think. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, because the N64 version had five on five play. But then there was jam mode, I think, that made it regular two on two. All right, I could well, be wrong. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let the game play itself. Uh, okay. The Utah uh, Jazz. Nope, it's still five on five. So anything after the SNES uh, was just, hey, look, a regular sports game pretending to be the arcade version. Oh, yeah, this was the finals of 1998, wasn't it? Yep. Ron Harper. Number nine. Number nine. Number 99. Michael Jordan, without being Michael Jordan. Yeah, because we couldn't get the rights to him. Scotty Pippen. Scotty Pippen. Scotty Pippen. Dennis Rodman. The definition of pee pain. This is cool, coach. Only no, Luke Longley. Luke Longley. Uh, what about his cousin, Luke Shortley? <laughs> no. Here's the Jazz, Carl Malone. No, that's white. That, yeah, that's clearly Carl Malone. White, white Carl Malone. <laughs> Carl Malone. Carl Malone. Horny check. <laughs> Jeff Horny chick. <laughs> Marl Cologne. <laughs> Carl Malone. 
Carmel Lone. Oh, actually, Carmel Lone. <laughs> Uh, no, that's John Stockton. Everybody knows. John Stockton. He's 6'9". black John Stockton. And Greg, Greg Osteoporosis. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe they couldn't get the rights to Jordan in this. I mean. What's so hard to believe about that? I mean, it's not like he costs several bazillion dollars. That's true. But there were other games that had him yeah, in it, wasn't there? Literally, most the most famous None fucking of the basketball NBA player. Games. Yeah, we we actually played an NBA game uh, NBA game on here not too long ago that it had him credited as roster guard. Yeah, he's literally the most famous basketball player basketball of all player time. Ever. Of course, it's going to cost money to get him. Money that I'm pretty sure Acclaim never had. Yeah, more, more <laughs> famous than uh, Shaquille O'Neal and Bill Lambeer. Yep. That's why combat basketball didn't take off. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine if it was like Larry Bird's combat basketball or something? That might have done well. Larry Bird has been on a might couple of other better. games. At Bird versus Jordan, anyone? Yeah. Yeah. It still wouldn't have made the game any better. Probably not. Yeah, this is this is a far cry from what NBA Jam normally no, this is. No, uh, Far Cry is a first-person shooter game. It's made by Ubisoft. Where's the fire? Where's the fire? He just said he was on fire. Where's the fire? Calm down. We'll send an ambulance, a fire truck soon. I didn't realize it. Apparently, there was also an NBA Jam Extreme. Okay. How can you get more extreme than NBA Jam? Everybody's pl- everybody's naked. Sega Saturn. Everybody's nude. There's NBA Jam, NBA Jam Tournament Edition, NBA. Oh Jam man, extreme. roster guard, roster guard just knocked John Stockton down with his enormous penis. <laughs> hey everybody, did you see? Roster guard in Space Jam? <laughs> Better than uh, Kobe Bryant in Space Jam 2. Well, <clears throat> that's um, that's lovely, but he wasn't in Space Jam 2. That was, that was LeBron James. <clears throat> I, you could substitute literally any basketball player and it still wouldn't make any difference. That movie's still blue. <laughs> true. <laughs> first one I mean, wasn't have... the first one wasn't like an overarching like movie, de- definitive movie of cinema or anything. But listen, the Animaniacs and Rick and Morty were in the second Space Jam movie. Same I mean, race. When Bill Murray is the guy that has to save the day, and it's no, there's no ghosts involved. There's a problem. So apparently Ooh, right. NBA Jam would stop doing console versions in 2000 and moved to the Game Boy Color for 2001 and Game Boy Advance for 2002. Fun. And neither of them were that good. I can't imagine why. Um... Yep, we didn't go back to Classic Jam until, well, kind of. Uh, There was NBA Jam 2003, which was a three-on-three basketball game on the PlayStation 2 and Xbox. And then NBA Jam would not come back again until uh, 2010 on the Wii. I was going to say, I was sure it was some WiiWare game or something like that. Uh, PlayStation 3, 360, Wii, iOS, Windows Phone, Android, and Mac OS X. And, uh, yeah, it wasn't that bad. I got it on the PS3, actually. They even got Tin Kits row back. He takes a quick one. <laughs> they, uh, they commentating on Billy going to the bathroom. He takes a quick one. <laughs> 
<laughs> Ooh, what <laughs> stinks in here? <laughs> sure. I was like, he's on like fire. <laughs> he's on fire. <laughs> Well, that's what happens when you have too many flaming Cheetos. Though. I don't know. I don't know whose bathroom you're watching, man. But that's nothing. He does not take a quick one. <laughs> <laughs> he brings it, he brings I'll, dinner and a movie in there. <laughs> I'll tell you, Bob. It smells like Billy shit a dead guy. <laughs> <laughs> This is one of those moments, Bob, where I wish I had COVID because that takes away your sense of smell. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, poor Billy is not here to felt, defend his smell self. His smell also. <laughs> well, yeah, his smell too. I'll tell you, Bob, if I could, I would rip my fucking nose off. <laughs> That would just make the hole for your smell bigger. <laughs> I don't, that, would well, not, that would not accomplish much. Well, it would make it would distract from the smell because of all the blood gushing out of my <laughs> nose hole face. <laughs> face nose hole? Yeah. That's, right. that's. I don't think I fucking stuttered, Bob. I don't think I stucking futtered. Stucking futtered. <laughs> Are they chanting penis? No defense, Jace. Who goes to a basketball penis. game? Who goes to a basketball game and chants penis? Philadelphia sports fans. Hey, <laughs> by the way, I never take a short time in the bathroom. I, I we uh, did we established that yes. <laughs> it's always a long fart. It's always a long poo. And it is uber stinky, and it would make your nose fall too, off. Too long, poo. Thanks for everything, Julie Pumar. <laughs> you know what? I'm proud of my my stool. <laughs> well, somebody's got to be proud of it. It's hefty and healthy. Okay. I'm proud of my stool, Billy Carter, 2024. As a matter of fact, <laughs> yes. Memorial Day 2024. I'm going to post that on Facebook. Yeah, this is we're recording this on Memorial Day for everybody wondering. Memorial Day. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Proud of my stool. I make good BMs. Hulk Hogan 2019. <laughs> Cheeto penis. Arsenio Hall, 2027. Yeah, Billy, you'll get a laugh out of the most recent thing I sent you. Oh, Lord, here we go. Did you get that thing I sent you? Did you get that thing? Did you get that, that thing, thing that, that I sent you? I sent you. Oh, Lord. It's all a lie. I never sent it's anything so to begin with. <laughs> it's so uh, drippy. No, wait, it, uh, it's so drippy, huh? Well, uh, that that show, that show, my God, that show. Yeah. Um, no, well, I, I, I did get that blankets, thing I sent you. Supercharged twerk flanks. <laughs> supercharged twerky twerk flanks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm even, I'm even posting it in a nice diarrhea turn. Electro powered brown color. clap cakes. Electro powered clap cakes. I have I'll posted on Facebook Billy's quote. That, that's, that's a good one to use. Electro powered clap cakes. I am proud of my stool, has now been immortalized on Facebook for eternity. Anyway, thoughts on NBA Jam 99, Dane? It was interesting. And well, if you see one Jam game, you see them all, but it wasn't terrible. I didn't mind it. Jason? It's good, but it's not NBA Jam. NBA Jam is two-on-two -two basketball. This is just a regular old basketball game. I'm sure if you'd Ass. known that, I'm sure if, they'd, if you'd have known that, there would have been a, a veto. Billy? Doge. 
Ah, it's not like that SNES version. Yeah, it's a uh, the the fact that it has the name Jam on it is uh, is seems like a huge misdirect because um, it is not NBA Jam. It's more like NBA Scam. It's more like NBA Ham. Scores out of, scores out of ten, Dane. Seven. Jason. Four. Billy. Because it wasn't over the top two. I'm gonna give it a five. On this edition they of the didn't show, have the original announcer. No, they don't. Marv Albert. <laughs> anyway, on this edition of the show, we played Scars, Quake, and NBA Jam '99. Best game of the episode, Dane. It is Quake by default. Jason. <sighs> Quake, I guess. Billy. Quake. Yeah, Quake wins, which means Mike's choice stay on, Mike's choice stays on the wheel because <laughs> the game I picked won. Uh, okay. Thanks for joining us for this edition of uh, Retro Roulette. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe and be sure to the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Dane Ford, Gio, and Jason Amherst, and Billy Carter, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time. <laughs>